Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. As usual, I'm in fourth place here. Um, not what I want to see when I'm playing as number two in the world and uh, trying to get two wins in a row to, to get to number one. But uh, we'll do our best here. Otherwise, uh, yeah, we might even drop to, ooh, we could drop to, we could drop to four if we lose this. I don't know. Let's see how strong the opponents are. I think that, that gets factored in a lot. Um, so, 156 last season, and he's still playing his ranked games. So, strong player. Uh, Terminator 59 this season, 1325 last season. He's doing well, so he could be pretty good as well. And Bendix, 643 and 430. So, uh, yeah. Um, what was Agron last season again? 156. Okay. So they're all they're all potentially good, but no one's uh, you know top top 20 or anything like that. Um, very high wood board. There's really only two brick spots. So the brick's going to be pretty valuable here. Um, the brick port's pretty useless. Um, The wheat's like average, the ores average, sheep's average. But with all the wood on the board, the brick's quite valuable. Um, and you got the two three for one ports there. Um, let's see. The eight, eight, four, five, ten, five, eight is pr a pretty absurd setup. And there's also the six, three, four, ten, five, eight. So red really should be taking the ten, five, eight here and locking up that brick. Um, like, it, yeah, okay. I was gonna say it, it, we'd pretty much have this in the bag if he didn't do that. Um, However, we still have a phenomenal setup, right? Um, so the eight five eleven is a twelve point spot, and the six four nine is also a twelve point spot, which is pretty unreal to get at this point. Yeah, um, Black kind of made a huge mistake here um, with this wood port idea, which just left these ridiculous spots for us. Red played correctly and blue played correctly. Um, so, Yeah, I mean, there's two 12-point spots. How would we not take these two? We double on the four wheat, but we just pick up that three-for-one on the left side, and we get to process all this production. Um, so, yeah, we'll just take the or wheat second. So the 649, we point left. Like, is there any other idea here? No, there's no way we're taking anything other than those two 12-point spots. Um, that 6-3 will also still be there. So we're going to take the 6-4-9 first. Um, so the 6-3 up here will still be there, but it's like... Like, we don't... It's not going to be that easy to get these roads without brick, unless we can get some trades from red. So let's just point left and go to the three for one. And then... I, I guess 
Black's pretty committed to this wood port idea at this point. Um, unless he wants to take like the 11, 10, 3 or something like that, but it just, he's already so, so committed to this. Um, does he go for the wood sheep on the 10, 9? Or does he go for the wood ore on the 8, 3? Or does he go for the wheat? I'm worried he goes for the 8-3. I, I, if we point either way, he'll pro he might just take the one we point at. Um, we're not taking the 4-5-11. Uh, I don't think. Nah, it doesn't. It's, the production difference is too high, I think. Um, and then we leave the 8-3-4 open. Whereas if we take the 8-4-5, we just block out all these good spots on the way back. So, uh, red needs ore and wheat. So red probably takes the 11-6-3. But then he has no wood. But he has a natural trading partner for wood with black and I. So that he probably takes the 6-11-3. Black takes one of the spots at the top, I think, the 8-3 or the 8-10. Or he could just take the 6-11-12, which leaves blue, like, what? The 9-10-11, the maybe? I don't know. I don't... I guess we'll just point... Uh, I guess we'll just point left. If we point right, black, Black's for sure going to just take the 810. Um, but if we point left, he still might take the 810. So let's just point left. Yeah, I mean, this, the choices of the spots there and the order to take the spots was pretty obvious. Uh, it was all just about the roads here. Yeah, I mean, for, for fourth pick, we got this is a phenomenal fourth pick setup. Um, we we're doubled on the wheat. Oh, red red's really gonna go wheatless. Yeah, I don't know about that, dude. Um, the ten five eight was correct, but or was the ten five eight correct? In hindsight, maybe not, because I ended up just locking him out of all the good spots at the top of the board. Um, but yeah. I, I, I guess he, he just locks up road now, right? And maybe he gets to, with all these roads, he gets to build back to the middle of the board from the bottom. Yeah, I guess he's got to pair the wood with it. I, I don't know. He, he's not, his or wheat sheep game's just not strong enough, but he, he's in for a long haul without any, uh, without any wheat. Um, okay. Leaving black, no choice here. I guess black could have taken the 6-3, but... So it's a good thing we pointed left. This was the only way that our road was at all useful. Um... I guess that makes sense for black because I guess it makes sense because he he leaves the 6311 for himself but what's blue actually going to do here the 63 yeah that's okay the 92 
All right, I guess we're going to hold. We've been identified as being extremely strong early, which is uh, tough, but... Four sheep for a wood just to drop the road to the brick. Yeah, I don't know about that blue. Uh, the two five brick is that is that really your? I get he's trying to pair the two five brick with the ten wood when he gets to the nine ten, but it's just slow. He's got almost he's got basically pure or wheat sheep, and he's like planning out two two road settles. Why not just go to the nine ten first, or go to the go to the two just go to the three for one. Okay, um, so we can drop a road or we can buy a dev. Um, I think we'll hang on to the ore and the wheat for now. Um, we really want to get a city up, so uh, let's just drop the road. There's also like a risk of red kind of coming around pretty quickly and plowing us over there. So, um, I guess he wants the three for one at the bottom as well. Uh, so maybe it's not that big of a risk, but, but he produces just so many roads. We can't discount that. So let's, we don't, we don't want to just start buying devs and, you know, wait for the year of plenty or the, uh, road builder to, to go for that settle. Shit. He's gonna block the ore. So I think, uh, I think we can buy the dev now. Since our ore's blocked, we're not gonna be able to city next turn. And we're not gonna be able to, well, I guess we could settle with a four and an eight. But, um, yeah, let's see, who, who are we even scared of right now? Blue, I guess, is our army competition. But we can also use the knight to like, I don't know, do we really want to hope that a four and an eight roll in the next four rolls? Even if that happens, we'd be over eight card, seven cards, and we'd be at risk of sevening out potentially. Let's, let's just buy the dev. I think, uh, I think blue bought a dev, black bought a dev. I'm 
not sure I believe that blue has no ore. Red got my ore. I guess we'll just hit the sheep. Um, red got my ore and didn't buy a dev with it. Maybe red will go for something like this. Should we offer this for a brick? This is extreme. Wow, you won't even do the three for one. Um, I guess we'll hold. I don't want to just pour all the wheat away when it's kind of hard to roll fours. Um, it's a shame we got a wood from orange there, or from red. Happy to be robbed here. Thank you. Well, it didn't matter. So, uh, okay, we got, we got the settle.
What is red o black? I must have missed that. Um What do we want to do here? We can port for a or but we're still kind of going to need a perfect set of rolls next turn, like a five and two sixes, or it's going to be pretty hard. I think we should just buy another dev. Actually, um, let's keep the robber off of us. Army could be very competitive with blue this game. Um, so let's, let's just buy another dev here. Yeah, I just don't understand Blue not trying to get a 3-for-1 port to process all this excess this excess sheep that he has. Um, there's also a strong potential for us if we can grab a Monopoly that we can take Road. Do we really want to play the knight off the eight wood? I, I don't think we want to waste our knight. The uh, the eight wood's just not a very valuable spot for us. Uh, it doesn't help us a ton. Okay, I think that's a, that's definitely a city for red. So hopefully a seven rolls. If blue beats red to the. I guess red red's gonna have five subtle spots basically. Uh, this doesn't no. It's got to be an ore. We don't care about the brick right now. I'm I'm not building to that six three. Maybe we should have done it for the brick wheat. No, I, th I thought we might be able to get the ore that he had. Um, yeah, so uh, red's just like way strong now. Uh, so let's play the uh, let's play the knight now and just rob red. Uh, so we're still a four away from cityying, so I think we can just buy another dev here. Maybe we get a monopoly or something, but this is this is going bad here. Um, I guess we could just get two fives and like a six. All right, let, let's hold. We're not getting robbed anymore. Let's let's save up for the city.
Um, so two devs or a city. Uh, I think it's just got to be the city on the ore here. Yeah, I mean, Blue just played this terribly. Like, the, the settle on the 5-2 was, was really ba bad. Like, I'd probably want to use a stronger word than that, but... So let's see if we can keep red at bay here with, with devs, but we've been lucky to get a, a good amount of fours. We don't really, we just need fours or fives now. The eights and sixes can get us the, the extra resource. And if blue's going to buy devs, then that should keep the robber off our five at least. Um, a sheep for a wheat, two wheat. A wood for a wheat. Just doesn't get us a dev even so. Dude, speak up. If you're gonna do it with red. Okay. That's the most expensive dev of all time if we do this trade. I'm just not, I'm not going to do it. Black's pretty strong here. He can take army for the time being. And he can take road too, uh, temporarily. Does he have the knight? Maybe. So we'll dump. I 
Actually, maybe we should keep the wood. Yeah, let's keep the wood and dump, uh, do it like that. Uh, that gives us a dev if an eight or a six rolls. Okay, we're going to find out if Black has army here. that monopoly and I want to take road with it and win the game. Yep. Okay, that was close. So we're actually a brick away from settling the 6-3, but I think army is the priority right now. Uh, okay, and then we'll drop. Man, red so freaking builds road so fast, he could just plow us over there. And we're never gonna take road long term. Should we even build to the 6-3 or should we just build to the desert wasteland? Is that a crazy idea? I think Red wants to settle that 10-9 first and the 9. Now he, but he might have to continue to extend. Um, I don't want to waste these roads. Uh, All right, I think we got some time to drop a settle, hopefully. Oh, that's... That's a great seven. Who gets robbed here? Probably red. Eh, I don't know. Probably us. It's close. Should be red, really. He can drop these two settles pretty fast. Um,
Black's pretty, pretty in big, pretty big trouble. Let's say because he loses Rodan army, um, and he definitely can't get both anymore. It's just way too much. Uh, okay, he's gonna go for Rodan instead. Yeah, I mean, I didn't want to lie about the dev, so... I guess we gotta just rob... That was huge to be able to get that wheat from blue. Um, oh shit, I should have done the ore for the wheat to get that settle. Is that, did I just make a huge mistake? Um, Uh, I guess after that, shouldn't King make, um, then they're not going to trade me, so let's just buy another dev. Whew! Okay. Uh, Red, Red needs to pull forward or city, though. He can't build two more settles, um. A wheat for a wood now. So there's a lot of wood out there that we could mono. Um, let's drop our settle first. Okay, now there's eight to ten. There's eleven, nine to eleven wood out there including our own. Um, so there's seven to nine wood to be monopolied. Uh, I don't know if we even get a city for it, so let's just hold. Be slightly patient on the monopoly. Red's not winning this turn. And black can... Uh, Black can potentially take uh, take road and uh, And blue seems to be, uh, is blue threatening our army? 
Man, Black has a lot of cards. He's going to be at nine points after this turn. Can he pull for the win here? Maybe he'll get conflicted and start to buy some devs. That's for the win. Blue has some VPs in his hand. Whew, okay. Um, Okay, that's an amazing roll. Um, so we'll just drop our city here. Although there is this tiny risk of losing, uh, losing army to black if he pulled a knight. There's still six knights left. Um, I don't know what's in black's hand. Um, but if he gets like... An 11, he can probably buy a dev. Do we really want a dev when we can city? Man, this is close. Um, I think we gotta just city here and take the risk and just hope there's no 11. I love the eight. Keep an eye on blue as well. Um, he seems to have a mountain of VPs in his hand. So how many roads? We need five roads to settle. So that'd actually be a single eight if the eight gets unblocked. I mean, five roads to take road. Um, if we could like roll an eight on our turn and it's not blocked. Or even just like a six and a five is gets us really close. No eleven. I like the nine, and he didn't play a knight anyways, so um, he doesn't have a VP. We know that because it would have been game over last turn. He might have the other monopoly. That should be the settle for red. Um, black still has no cards. Three wood for a wheat. OK. 
Okay, we just roll. Is that enough to build five roads? No, we'd have to. There'd have to be fifteen sheep out there to port all the sheep. Orange built a settle. So there's orange or red built one. So blue has three. That's seven. What did black get? A wheat. I think we just take all the sheep here. Oh, blue has six devs? Yeah, we gotta just take all the sheep. How many do we get? 13. Um, yeah, we're, we're, one, we're one short of road. Um, damn. Uh, we could road, road, settle. Here, let's port for a wheat. Um, let's go quickly. So we could road, road, settle, and buy a dev. Let's just buy the dev first. A knight, great. Uh, do we have the road, road, settle? No, we don't have it anymore. Um, so we'll just buy another dev. Yeah, we can't city. Um, man, I fucked this up, I guess. Yeah, I had road with one more card. Um, maybe we should have just cityed. Um, Do we port this for something? I don't think blue knows what to monopoly at this point, so let's just hold. It's not like they're gonna believe me anyways. Man, I guess I should have just cityed, right? Um, I, I wanted to pull first to be able to try to win, like, I don't I miscalculated that. There's so many cards and we had just all wood and sheep. Um, There's still devs left. Um, maybe Black's holding a road builder or a monopoly. Um, so Black's just trying to take road and with the road builder. What's in red's hand? Three brick. Actually, blue might have all five VPs. All right. Um, we do have the city this time. Uh, Blue is saying that we might be able to steal to win here, making me think he doesn't have all five VPs. Um, we can buy two devs. I think we just buy two devs. Like, the city city... Do we just double down on devs here? The city city's hard. Um, we're going for the de two devs. Okay, we got the last VP. We might have just saved, saved ourselves. Um, yeah, we already played the knight. Okay, so that's the same thing as the city, basically, getting that VP. Uh, yeah, so I think blue is at eight points. And he would have cityed and pulled that last VP for the win here. Now orange or red can't pull for it.
Black says he doesn't have a mono. He's suggesting blue monos. Um, brick mono. He has four VPs. Is this game, though? Yeah, that's probably game for blue. Now there's more devs left. He might not have all four. The suspense. Wait, does he not have... He, he's got to have the settle, right? He doesn't have the settle. Was there an 11? Is that game for black with his road builder? Black has to have a road builder, I think. Why would Blue build a road? Oh, Blue built a road because he used the Monopoly. He couldn't use a road builder in a Monopoly. I guess Black pulls for it here. Oh, he had a year of plenty. Whoa. Come on, four. So... Red just pulled for the win. Do we roll? Let's roll. Oh, yes! We win! What a miracle. Let's see what the score was. Was Blue at nine and just couldn't settle? Yeah, Blue had four VPs and with all ten cards he couldn't settle. Incredible. So we're still number two, but we are now eight points off from number one. Um, a lot of sixes. Yeah, not a lot of sevens here. There wasn't a lot of seven outs. Uh, yeah, so the uh, dice stats here. Um, the two, like, never... It did roll once, I guess. Um, threes, fours, sixes, eights, and nines were really heavy. Threes, fours, sixes... Yeah, we had a stacks of wood all game, and the sheep, and the wheat. But the fives were lighter. Um, so the... The sixes were off the charts for, yeah, so these guys had all the wheat all game. Or, well, black just got there at the end, but blue had all the wheat all game. The, and the fours, eights, and nines. Yeah, the wheat, the roads, and the sheep. Pretty, kind of balanced, and the fours also gave black. The, it, it, the dice 
were a little lopsided, but I think they didn't really favor anyone too heavily, unless I'm missing something. But all right, guys, we're one win away from number one in the world. So uh, look out. Catch you next time.